jumping ward was cleared and taken down. Overpower. Look at this, just waiting off at the side there. He realizes both nearby. Nick's gonna face check straight in towards him. He's gonna eat a shark. It's a giant earth this time around, of course. And he will do nothing. And Overpower didn't want to follow. He knew Diamond was nearby. So just cut the flash out of Nick. Well, uh, good, good enough for him. He needs to be careful here, though. Slow landing from Diamond as well. They're going for it. Good satchel charge. Flashes from both of them. Overpower taking low on this one. Playful tricks are not available. And Nick just burns him down with the bomb. Favorite boy, despite the. Uh, Good start here from Gambit. It is only 11 minutes gone, and now oh, he's in coming. trouble. Teleport comes down. Zazas is going to go towards him. Edward will go down. It's overpowered. Tell a lie. Teleports in and gets himself a free kill. And instantly, Rocket now moving towards the dragon. Push it in again here. Double range. Some decent wave play as well. Just constantly pushing the waves here. Yangos needs to be careful. Yangos face check and gets hooked in. Eddie's on there. Teleport comes down. Yangos is going to repel, but he's got nowhere to run. Kubon came a little too late to that party. He didn't manage to get himself the assist. It's the second kill for Gambit. Top in his top lane to stay in one-on-one. -on -one. Gambit, they are starting the dragon here. TB coming in, starts very far behind her. It's however. a fast dragon, and Diamond manages to outsmite Yankos there, who both win in. It's a fight between the two. Pops his stealth, gets himself a little bit of stealth cover. Zazas moves in. Mega Inferno Bomb goes in towards there. Nice Diamond. Pulls Zazas into his team. I'm not sure they wanted that with his ultimate running. And Gambit are on the retreat here. But Rocket are very, very low. Eddie gets caught out. He will go down. It's still only a one for zero. And remember, Gambit got oh, himself. Another range. That Opa's behind them. Dragon coming around the side, up towards it. There we go, just pounding into the screen. Overpower cannot get close enough. Chum the warners. Oh, it doesn't matter because Genja gets caught out. That's the AD carry down. And it's a two for zero. Can they take the tower? Otherwise, they're just looking to kite backwards. Diamond here. Oh, fish coming in for Warpower. Oh, Chum the warners will land this time around. Diamond oh, in trouble. Down. The lantern gets thrown out. He stealths away. Oh, Zazas is pulled in. Goes in, gets himself the kill. He may pay the price with his own life, but he's a man. Tanky monster, and he's keeping us alive. He's locking onto Nick. Nick's in trouble. He's gonna get locked down. Tries to jump away. Will get caught out. Now Genja's gonna be focused on. Can he take the lantern? Yes. No. Oh, just about missing caliber net back and forth. But that is Gambit absolutely out of the picture for this one. Mega Inferno Bomb. Can he go for the steal? Kubon's gonna throw something out. No. Nick caught out. He goes down. Overpower gets the kill. Chum the waters. Catches onto Kubon. He's the big tanky machine. But is he strong enough? He's got that sadism run. He can see he's taking everything from Rocket to try and shut him down. Baron was taken in amongst all of that as well. And Rocket continued to turn the pressure on. And Gambit are in real, real danger now. Oh, so has been hooked. No, nope. to half health already. 7,000 hit points. Oh, Diamond caught out. That's going to be problems. Lantern was thrown out. He flashed the opposite direction. And that means Diamond is going to all sorts of trouble. Gets himself a giant heal there. Nick comes up. Overpower does manage to use the Zonius, but he will get the kill onto Diamond. We see Genja going down. Rockhand making all sorts of problems. And Gambit are sinking without a trace here. They've been so, so passive throughout the game. Zazas continues to chase. He's just happy to taunt Gambit and pressure the next couple of weeks. Long way to go, but right now, Rocket continuing. Edward just gets melted by Yankos. That's the jungler just destroying him. Nick gets taken down. Sonia's Hourglass, not enough. Overpower pops his own. Kubon gets dropped in a matter of seconds, and Rocket completely cleaning up here against Gavin. This is not a problem for them. It looks like they're going to be taking a 4-0 victory over Gambit. Something that honestly, if you'd have told them back in the spring when they qualified for the LCS, they would have thought it was impossible. But it seems that Gambit will be going out of the LCS. They will not make it to the playoffs. And Rockout will indeed look to try and secure that sixth spot. It's a great victory for them, yeah. but it's a terrible, terrible loss for Gambit.